Hey everyone, this is me, Sakya here, and I'm back with another reading, which is going to be a pick a card, and the reading is going to be about angel number. What angel number is coming in for you in this reading, and what is the message coming through for you that you need to hear? I'm going to tap into all of that in this reading. So I have two piles here, green stone and red hat. Pick whichever one, whichever you're more drawn to, and whichever you want to choose for yourself to know the angel number and the guidance around it as well so yeah uh, just be mindful it's a general reading it's um it's it may and it may not resonate with everyone out there so pick whatever resonates and leave the rest and for personalized services you can always reach out to me on the email id in the description box so let's see with the first um pile first the green pile let's see what angel number is coming in for you and what is the message with that let's see for the people who are choosing the green pile the angel number for you and what's the message with it okay let's see zero four four zero the gut feeling intuition betrayal pessimism relating Value, insight, increased perception, love, monogamy, follow your gut. It's more than just a feeling. Be real with people and focus on meaningful relationships. Remember, you also bring value to the table. Treat others with respect and else. Kava will bite your ass. Three is a coward. Three is a crowd. Oh, I just said coward. Hmm. I feel like, you know, for some of you, uh, you might be in a third party situation right now that the karma is going to come and bite you if you are in a third party situation, especially where you are the third person and uh, the person that you're dealing with is already married. So just, just know that is this big, big message coming here for all of you out there. So don't be um, involved into anything, some, you know, like that right now. Um, I really feel like, you know, you can already foresee some sort of a comic um, reward coming your way. Um, just just know that if you have been saying 0440 a lot lately, the gut feeling is telling you something that you're probably not doing right. You have to um, look deeper into something right now in the given situation um, and try to be more real with people right now. Um, try to focus on one more meaningful relationships as well. Um, you must bring something good to the table. Um, I feel like, you know, for some of you, you might also be like settling in for a third party situation, knowing that what you're signing up for, but you need to know that you're valuable and you need to bring, um, you know, you need to choose something valuable for yourself. Don't settle in for less. Um, and if, again, it's very important right now for you to know that, you know, in relationships, three is definitely is a crowd. So make sure that you choose yourself, um, you know a relationship which is between you and your specific someone where there's no such third party involved uh so again you have to be very watchful of all of that uh choose love choose healthy relationships and listen to your gut feeling because there is something that your gut feeling is telling you that you're avoiding right now so especially if you have been seeing zero double four zero it's a big sign that this is a message that you need to hear right now so that's pretty much it for the people who chose green stone and let's move on to the people who chose red hat. Let's see, what is the angel number for you and what is the message along with it? Angel number for you and the message along with it. Ooh, you got two angel numbers. So I'm just gonna take both of them. We do have triple eight, comma, balance finances success wealth cycles what goes around comes around so i really see um karmic rewards coming your way a lot of money is coming your way fortune refers to more than just monetary material success if you don't appreciate the people in your life now you won't have them tomorrow so um this message encourages you to take personal responsibility and use it to realize your greatest potential. I feel like, you know, the divine really wants you to know that, you know, there is definitely growth, financial abundance coming your way with number triple eight, if you have been seeing that a lot. 
Um, but it's also a number where you need to know what goes around, comes around. So if you have been doing something, um, which is like, you know, if, if you take things for granted, just know that tomorrow they won't be there. So you need to take care of the things that you own and have value them till they last and be that people relationship situations uh, that you take for granted you have to know that they're not gonna stay there forever so there's some sort of a message that um i don't know why but i'm picking up a very dark energy here so you might be losing something or someone if you don't take care of it so make sure that you take care of your loved ones and value the connections that you have with them so you don't have to um worry later on or feel regret uh, for not loving them uh, when they were with you. So make sure that you take um, action accordingly if that resonates with you in your situation at all. Uh, let's see the next message um, coming from the angels. One, two, one, two. If this is something that you have been seeing a lot lately, um, this message is definitely for you. Persistence, shift, enthusiasm, gratitude, contentment, new experiences. Oh, happy day. An ample opportunity related to your life's purpose is around the corner. Take immediate action once it's pop up. Of course, a loving partnership or an epic romance is also in the cards. Hmm. Hmm. I really feel like, you know, um, for some of you, you really don't see where your life is heading right now. Just know one thing, that there is um, a wonderful opportunity coming your way which is gonna bring you the romantic connection which you probably long for or which you probably ask for or seek in your life right now um if you have been seeing that number a lot lately with number 888 i really feel like you know, it's high time that you are going to meet someone who's going to be very filthy rich and somebody who's going to be like um it's gonna love you value you if you have not been valued by the other people in the past in your love life and just know one thing that um whatever your past relationships have been like they have been in your life to play their purpose and they have played their purpose and now it's time for you to move towards your soulmate connection so whatever connection that you're making right now and the connection that is that i see coming towards you it's going to be like a big huge shift coming in your life and you will be happy for the ending that might have happened in in the in the past so i really see a loving relationship is coming your way and you have to take immediate action i really feel like you know something panning out for you in your love life very quickly very fast uh which you're probably not going to be feeling like you know you're prepared for it but yes there is like um I really see that, you know, especially if you have been seeing both the numbers uh, together, like, you know, maybe you have been seeing a lot of 888 and 1212. Um, I really see something big coming through for you in regards to your love life. There is a big shift coming in and I really see you moving forward with a loving offer coming your way and leaving the past behind, leaving the, you know, learning from the past experiences and moving on with the soulmate. So that's what I see coming through for you um, in this, um, you know, read. With the messages coming from the angels around you if it was of help don't forget to like share and subscribe till i do the next read take care bye